Certainly. Here are 70 amazing facts about dugongs. Dugongs, often referred to as sea cows, are marine mammals, they are part of the order Serenia, which also includes manatees. Dugongs are closely related to manatees, but they have some distinct characteristics. These creatures inhabit warm coastal waters in the Indian and Western Pacific Oceans, they prefer shallow waters with seagrass beds, which serve as their primary food source. Dugongs are herbivores, feeding primarily on seagrasses and algae. Their diet consists mainly of marine vegetation, consuming up to 30 kilograms 66 pounds, of seagrass daily. Dugongs have a streamlined body shape, which helps them glide effortlessly through the water. Their bodies are covered in tough, wrinkled skin, which is sparsely covered in hair. Dugongs have paddle-like flippers, which they use for steering and propulsion. Adult dugongs can reach lengths of up to 3 meters, 9.8 feet, and weigh as much as 400 kilograms, 880 pounds. They have a distinctive, dolphin-like tail, which they use for propulsion. Dugongs have a unique snout with bristly whiskers, which they use to detect food. These mammals have poor eyesight but possess excellent hearing and sense of smell. Dugongs are primarily solitary animals, although they may form small groups for feeding or mating. They are generally slow-moving animals but can swim at speeds of up to 10 to 15 kilometers per hour, 6 to 9 miles per hour, when the Cesar dugongs are known for their long lifespan, with some individuals living up to 70 years in the wild. Female dugongs typically give birth to a single calf every two to seven years. The gestation period for dugongs is around 13 to 14 months. Newborn dugongs are about 1.2 to 1.5 meters, 3.9 to 4.9 feet, long and weigh around 30 to 35 kilograms, 66 to 77 pounds. Dugong calves rely on their mother's milk for nourishment, which they suckle underwater. The milk of dugongs is very rich in fat content, essential for the rapid growth of calves. Dugongs have few natural predators due to their large size and habitat preferences. However, they may fall victim to sharks, crocodiles, and killer whales. Humans pose the most significant threat to dugongs through habitat destruction, pollution, and accidental entanglement in fishing gear. Dugongs play a crucial role in marine ecosystems by maintaining the health of seagrass beds through grazing. Seagrass beds are vital habitats for numerous marine species, including fish, crustaceans, and mollusks. Dugongs are considered a keystone species in their ecosystems, meaning they have a disproportionate impact on their environment compared to their abundance. These mammals have been revered in various cultures throughout history, often featuring in folklore and mythology. Dugongs are known for their gentle demeanor, often described as docile and peaceful creatures. They communicate with each other using a variety of vocalizations, including chirps, whistles, and clicks. Dugongs are capable of making long-distance migrations in search of food and suitable breeding grounds. They have been observed traveling hundreds of kilometers during these migrations. Dugongs have a unique ability to regulate their buoyancy, allowing them to rest on the seafloor without expending much energy. These mammals have a slow metabolic rate, which helps them conserve energy. Dugongs are most active during the day, feeding primarily in the early morning and late afternoon. They have a specialized digestive system adapted to digesting tough seagrass fibers. Dugongs can hold their breath for up to 6 minutes while underwater. They typically surface every 3 to 5 minutes to breathe, but they can remain submerged for longer periods if necessary. Dugongs are listed as vulnerable to extinction by the International Union for Conservation of Nature IUCN. The main threats to dugongs include habitat loss, pollution, boat strikes, and illegal hunting. Conservation efforts are underway to protect dugongs and their habitats, including the establishment of marine protected areas and the enforcement of regulations against hunting and habitat destruction. Dugongs have been hunted for their meat, oil, and other body parts for centuries. Traditional hunting of dugongs continues in some parts of their range, despite legal protections. Dugongs have been depicted in art and literature for centuries, symbolizing tranquility and connection to the ocean. 
The scientific name for the dugong is dugong dugong. Dugongs belong to the family Dugongidae and the genus dugong. The closest living relatives of dugongs are manatees, which belong to the family Trichetae. Dugongs are classified as marine mammals because they spend their entire lives in the water. The word dugong is believed to have originated from the Malay word duya, which means lady.